Well, earlier today, the community gathered in their red, white, and blue attire at a local park for an event celebrating the holiday. NBC 10's Haley Hines attended the event and has more details. We're getting into the holiday spirit here at Triangle Park, where we're celebrating the annual 4th of July Children's Parade. The Monroe Rotary Club hosted its annual 4th of July Children's Parade, bringing the community together for patriotic festivities. We spoke with a member of the Rotary Club and the brains behind the annual event on this year's and, parade. Uh, it's grown exponentially over the years, and we try to bring something new every year. You can see the, the Acadian Ambulance and the Bearcat that the Sheriff's Office brings, and we have games for the kids, and of course there's watermelon and snow cones. The parade features scooters, tricycles, and more decked out in red, white, and blue, putting on a glaring show for spectators. We spoke to a mother and her patriotic participants about the event. It gives these girls a reason to smile and they love everything about it. The balloons, the floats, everything is so much fun for them. Although it's named the Children's Parade, the event is fun for all, especially first time goers. This was proven true by the ULM head women's basketball coach who spoke about enjoying her first time at the event. It's just really awesome to see the community come together and put the work in for the kids to have a great event. And so we were excited to come out and just support them in that. As a first timer at the event myself, I must say it was definitely star studded. Reporting in Monroe, Louisiana for your Arklamis news source and a happy 4th of July, I'm Haley Hines.